It's been three days, and this prophet has yet to show himself. I hope I'm not making a huge mistake by trusting you. War Chief, the clans are assembling as you ordered, but it will take them some time to reach us. Then we must prepare this camp immediately. I want my warriors to have food and proper lodgings when they arrive. Yes, War Chief. Warrior, has there been any word from Grom Hellscream? He and the Warsong clan were supposed to have been here by now. No, War Chief. We haven't heard from Hellscream in some time. Damn it, Grom. Where the hell are you? We need more gold. What do you want? The blinking button at the top of the screen indicates that your quest journal has been updated. To find out more about your objectives, click on the quest button. Ah, uh, establish a base. An undiscovered quest. Alright. As far as I know, good. Finally, this is a game where I can select multiple buildings. Once a peon has been ordered to harvest gold, you will automatically travel back and forth between the gold mine and your closest great hall. Here are a few additional peons to increase the rate of gold collection. Let's get on with it. <laughs> Let's get on with it. The amount of gold that you currently possess is displayed in the upper right portion of your screen. As peons return to your great hall with gold, your gold stockpile increases. Training a unit takes time. When your great hall is selected, you can see a progress indicator in the bottom middle portion of your screen. Ready to work. So did he, did he just go? Yeah, he just kind of went to the gold mine. a larger population, additional orc burrows will have to be constructed. Burrows provide the food that allows you to train more troops. To construct a burrow, select one of your peons. You don't tell me what to do. Now, click on the build structure button in the command card. Which one is burrow right there? Oh god, I just saw the fucking key for that. Oh. In order to produce additional buildings, you must gather more lumber from the nearby forests. To harvest lumber, select a peon and right click on a nearby tree. You have just placed a rally point for your structure. Whenever a unit finishes training from this building, he will automatically travel to the rally point's location. To place a rally point, select one of your unit producing structures and right click on the ground where you want the rally point to appear. So everything is in units of 10. I, I understood that much. Now that your peon has been assigned to gather lumber, you will automatically travel back and forth between the forest and your closest great hall. Now what else do we need? A uh, war mill, barracks, and fire guns. Alright, start that. Oh, this is the one good thing they did. Uh, yeah, space bar. Uh, yeah. They made it so that the altar storms, now the units don't have to like... Well-placed war mills can increase the efficiency of your lumber harvesters. Try ordering a peon to construct a war mill near where your peons are chopping wood. Uh, where's the war mill? Uh, that needs a lot of gold actually. I was gonna say like the 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 heroes actually come back to life in this game, which is good. Uh, I think yeah, the cap is the cap is five for uh, for miners. <clears throat> All right, let's make a war mill somewhere. Happy to BM. All right, there you go. We got a couple of shit now. Anyways, um, yeah, the the heroes actually will come back to life with the altar. I think it costs like gold or something retarded. Um, am I not allowed to move items? Oh no, I have to right click on it first. Interesting. Okay. One of those things that you learn. Work complete. What do you want? I can do that. So gold, gold is kind of like. Continue producing grunts until you reach your quest requirement. Gold is kind of like that weird ass. Um, Let's get on with it. Yeah, let's uh, let's mm. let's actually go out and find that the, the quest that it wants me to do. Mm. I'm gonna just explore over here real quick. For so honor. it's like the vest being yeah. gas in a lot of ways. It's weird. The spirits are okay. restless. Can I tell him to follow him? Yeah, I can. The my life for the horde. For Very honor. good. All right, let me just talk you that. Work complete. Yes. Uh, do I have an idle peasant button? Well, let's see. Toggle minimap terrain. That's useless. Minimap creep display. Damn, son. Oh, toggle formation. Various upgrades that can be researched to improve your troops. To see what upgrades are available, select your war mill. Oh. 
Yeah, sure, we'll get some upgrades. Oh, here we go. Okay, that's much better, actually. For honor. Yeah, okay, well, let's, let's, honor. let's mess around with that. Yes. And we got that button there. I thought there was an idle peons button somewhere. I think it was like, I thought it was like F5 or something. Maybe, maybe no. that probably still is somewhere, but yeah. For honor. Might as well kill these guys. What? Really? Only hit one of them? You're lost. I am the warchief. Let's get on. Alright, nothing yes. else over here, really. Dabu. Yes. Dabu. I'll just eat that. The spirits. Ah, oh, but this has a cooldown. I am the warchief. Research to me. I hope it doesn't like continue the campaign when I uh is it an optional objective or uh it's just an undiscovered quest. Alright. I I don't know if it will just continue the game, so let's not do the five that wants me to do. Oh shit. A scroll of healing. What does that do? That is a to all non friendly non uh, sorry, to all friendly non mechanical units in the area. Oh boy. I am Alright, I'm gonna explore the map before we continue, just cause, you know. Oh shit, never mind, I lost. Did we just lose? We just lost, cause I didn't do the fucking quest. Oh wait, maybe that's what I'm supposed to do. You orcs are in violation of the Alliance Internment Act. We've already captured one of your leaders. If you surrender now, we'll spare your lives. Warchief, they say they've captured one of our leaders. Maybe they're referring to Grom. I hope not. But if they have captured Hellscream, I'll make them regret it. Lok Tarogar! Come, my warriors. We must drive the humans back. Alright, never mind. We can just keep upgrading everything. Our town is under Lok attack. Oh, so yeah, we weren't allowed to actually go that far. So it's all good. Chain lightning those dicks. For honor, I am the warrior. Look, Naro! What the hell is this guy doing? Get over here. Look, regard, Astro. I am the warrior. The wretched humans have been destroyed. Move Thrall and the rest of your forces across the bridge and locate Grom. Look, regard. But what's the other building we have here, actually? Something I didn't even notice. Doing? Altar of Storms, okay. Yeah, really nothing. One of your structures was damaged during the fight. To repair a damaged building, select a peon, click the repair button, and then left click on the desired yes. structure. I can do that. Yeah, I think I know. Just, I'm kind of like rallying them around. So what's it, what's it say now? Rescue Grom? How do we know it's Grom? I am the watcher. So they have scout towers. Felt the human scum. What will they learn? Let's get on with it. So I think this, yeah. So if I keep it under forty food, we have upkeep, and the upkeep system I think is it just saps a little bit of your money. So generally, you want to keep it. I, I think low at most, and then like high if you're doing like a big push, I guess. I am the war chief. For uh, honor. There's nothing up here. Yeah. Fuck windmills. Hmm. I like how they raised a bridge. For like, honor. The fuck? Hmm. How pretentious is that? Dabu. Oh, some sheep. The spirits are restless. Fuck them. Yes. I am the one. <laughs> I'm just gonna kill the sheep. Dabu. Attack, attack gates to destroy them. Um. Look, Naro! For Doom Hammer! Uh, apparently, you can kill the crates too. Yes. I don't know how much of this I'm going to be doing. Probably a lot. For honor. None will survive. Luckily, there's a key for me to select my hero. It's all good. Is yes. that really it? Oh, for shit. Honor. Oh, secrets. Oh, no. The spirits are restless. For Doomhammer. Sorry, I keep pressing spacebar. 
that's where I have it. That's where I have my hero key in uh, Starcat too. I am the war chief. All right, knock knock, mm. motherfuckers. For honor, we've come for Grum yes. Hellscream. Mm. It's not worth chain lightning. It's like Grum Hellscream. Your army has grown to such a large size that it now requires a portion of your income to sustain it. This maintenance cost is referred to as upkeep. Yeah, we, we don't really need to make any more units, I'll be honest. The spirits are restless. Build more burrow for honor. Yes. For honor. Oh, nothing really up yes. there. Hmm. I think I just macroed the shit out of this tutorial mission, I won't lie. The units are having trouble getting a good surround. Yeah. Let's get on with it. Hmm. Ah, spellcaster. Yes. When you control multiple spellcasters at the same time, it often becomes necessary to quickly switch between them to cast their individual spells. I am By using the, the subgroup chief. interface, you can do so without having Double. to try to select them individually. Which was actually the very much the currently selected nice. units are displayed hmm. in the bottom middle portion of your screen by little portraits. One of the unit portraits is highlighted with a yellow glow. This means that it is the currently activated subgroup. The spirits you can switch restless. between subgroups by pressing the tab key or left clicking yes. on one of the portraits that is not highlighted. This activates that subgroup and displays their spells Let's in your command line. I Fuck, I have too many units, and I have to make like two groups. Let's get on with it. Yes, Lord Chief. Time to die. Look I was wondering if I could de-aggro them by uh, clicking something else, but no. Look, Narosh. All right, it's uh. None will survive. Dumb. Open up every single crate in the game. Narosh. Yeah, okay, apparently those don't count as things we can open. Whatever, fuck mm. it. This tutorial's almost over. Dabu. Yes. And they have all the upgrades. I am. That was like, what I thought it was annoying about the combat in this game. The spirits. Like, are it takes a really long time to. Uh, mm. Yes. To honor. select all the units and everything. It's weird. Mm. Alright, yes. is there anything else here? Hmm. Are they just following me? Master, I guess they are. Let's get on with it. Oh the shit, they got knights. We found where they're holding Grom, but the area is secured by Fortnite Hog Tower. Right away. And destroy that Lopri Hellstream Hell must be free. Oh, let's get on with it. Lopri There you go, I healed the ball. Mostly because there's no other I point in this game where I'm ever gonna use that. Yes. We're under attack. All right, we got quite the force here. It's fine. Oh, uh, don't die! Oh, we lost one. Oh, might as well turn in my Warcraft three cred. We were going for a hundred percent perfect run of the tutorial. Why do we fucking hate the shaman? Oh my god, they hate the war chief so much. That's why they hate the shaman, not war chief. Right, yes, keep it back there. Probably make these guys move in. Yes. All right, are they gonna be racist against my shaman? Yeah, they are fucking racist. What the fuck? Right away. Fuck that bird. What do you want? Look, regard, no gun. Ah. Fine, little brother. Luckily, they only injured my pride. Great, because we're getting out of here now. We're leaving the human lands for good. Finally. Finally. I have an idea. <laughs> we can set sail on the humans' own ships. <laughs> Perfect. But we'll need to wait for the rest of the horde. The Horde is assembled, War Chief. 
We await only your command. Now, go, young Thrall. Sail west to the lands of Kalimdor. It is there that you will find your destiny. It is there that your people's salvation will be assured. Naval combat when? Yeah, there's no naval in this game at all. And that's the end. wonder if there's like a cutscene we could watch for this at the beginning. Alright, I'll take that as a yes. We'll watch that. enough. Agreed. The Horde is on the move. This is absurd. My nation will not stand by and watch the Horde masses on our very doorstep. The Orcs are not our primary concern here. How many times must I repeat myself? King Terranus, you must heed my warning. This plague that has gripped the Northlands could have dire ramifications. Let's keep all this in perspective. Even if this play does pose a threat to us, what are you proposing that we do? It is simple. As I have said, the Kirin Tor are already prepared to place the villages under strict quarantine. I will not institute quarantine without proof of your claims, Ambassador. The people of Lordaeron have suffered enough without becoming prisoners in their own lands. Prisoners they are, good king. What is the meaning of this? Who are you? Humanity is in peril. The tides of darkness have come again. And the whole world is poised upon the brink of war. Enough of this. Guards, remove this madman. Hear me. The only hope for your people is to travel west. To the forgotten lands of Kalimdor. Are you mad? Old Ambassador, I don't know who you are or what you believe, but this is not the time for rambling prophets. Our lands are beset by conflict, but it shall be we who decide how best to protect our people, not you. Now, be gone! I failed humanity once before, and I will not do so again. If you cannot take up this cup, then I shall find another who will. I'm not sure why he thought that anyone would listen to him, but okay. This fucking, like, goes from raven to human form in, like, the middle of a fucking thing, so. Like, in the middle of the room, like, arr, arr, go down south or whatever the fuck. Alright. Alright, lads, this is the end of this episode, so thanks a lot for tuning in, and uh, we'll start chapter one. Uh, defensive Strandbrad uh, next time, so take care, goodbye.